Senator Garn, he came and told us about how he was in NASA. That was cool. But I am pleased to be with you and talk to you about all the amazing opportunities that await you in the future. And I wish I had a wild enough imagination to guess what you will be able to do with your lives, but, but I simply don't. The speed of technological change is so much more rapid today than when I was your age, I can't even begin to guess all the amazing things that you will be able to use, to learn about, and to accomplish in your lifetimes. Some of the BYU players came and they talked to us. You know that every single one of you in this room is going to face things that are hard. You're going to wake up some mornings and you're going to think, this is, this is hard, I can't do this anymore. But you know what, those are the times that, that build your character. Today we all huddled up on the bus despite the rain and the weather. We all got together, got on the bus, headed out to the prison. The prison was really interesting. It was, um, it was very eye-opening to see the prison inmates and to hear what they had to say about what they did. And they were very open to all the questions. And I thought it was very interesting to just see them and talk to them. And they were just open about everything. And we got to sit down and talk to the prisoners about just um, some of the mistakes they've made and then what we could have done and how they could teach us and just a lot of just how they feel, you know, being in that situation and um, it was really cool. It was a good eye, it was a good eye opener because I bet a lot of people came in um, thinking, oh, these guys are hardened criminals and stuff, but it was really cool just to see the um, kind of the change of heart that it looked like these guys had. Fun experience, you get to come meet new people, all kinds of people, and get to know them, and everyone's wanting to do the same thing. They're all leaders, and so it's fun to get to know people who are doing the same thing you want to do, and the leaders of the state. Welcome to paradise.
most important, we welcome you, the 2011 Freedom Academy delegates from high schools throughout the state of Utah. You are the future, and we are very confident and very optimistic about the future because of what you bring and because of what you will take away from Freedom Academy, learning about service and citizenship and leadership and what it means to be an American and what that responsibility represents for each of us. said the world is run by, by the people that show up and, and as I look at you, you are the future of our society. You've chosen in your lives to get involved, You've chosen to be a part of something that's larger than yourself and so I commend you for that and I tell you that uh, that kind of behavior is what's required uh, for our country to remain strong. It has a maximum range of 